My horse has handiness level one. That is called talent. And now let's. Was that a kiss? What was that? Oh my god. Oscar is single. A single Pringle for me to mingle. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, you're flirting something. He's talking something nice. Oh my god. Hello there, honey buns, and welcome back to my horse ranch series in The Sims 4. So, as you can see, it is a beautiful night in Chestnut Ridge, and we are not home. We are not home because last we left off at the Reyes Ranch. As you can see, we have three beautiful Reyes brothers here, and Betty loves them all. So, I have decided to take each of them out on a date and decide which is gonna be my future husband starting with Oscar so from tomorrow on we're gonna be starting dating some Reyes brothers I hope you are ready for that but for now I'm gonna get on hope and I'm gonna go home because it's 11 p.m. in the night thank you guys so much for entertaining me Oscar I will be seeing you tomorrow and I hope you have a good night by the way if you're excited for this video don't forget to show your love subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you never miss any future videos of this series and now let me tell you what I have planned for my date with Oscar but first I'm gonna call hope to go to bed and Ayame you can go on ahead and sleep in your own bed So I have planned three individual dates with the brothers depending on what they like So for example with Oscar today I'm going to go to a fancy restaurant and we're gonna have a beautiful time with Franco I have decided to go to a club because you know he likes hanging out at bars and with Juan I was gonna have a cooking date We were gonna cook together and do some really fun stuff and I think that actually symbolizes what the guys want most what they like most and also of course I will be working on my horses skills such as endurance and temperament I'm gonna work on my horse riding skill take care of my sheep and goats take care of my garden sell some nectars and also create them so this is my plan for this episode I hope you're ready to see a lot of beautiful stuff oh look poop go on ahead and put this in your inventory as soon as you wake up honey uh, look at my beautiful sheep and goats sleeping inside my house there are only three of you weren't there more yeah Barbie croquetta where's croquetta go to my goat face and tina are here but where is croquetta croquetta what are you doing in the equestrian center what can i like call her over why is she there like what the hell okay i think we're good enough on sleep go get the horse poop after that wash your hands and brush your teeth be like a champion take a thoughtful shower and cook yourself some breakfast unless you have anything ready already oh you know what i don't have time for cooking let's just get some a kai bowl that sounds nice I want to take Hope on a trail ride, but I can see that my flowers need watering and maybe some weeding. And I think on some of them I have to spray for bugs. So please do that so that we can go on a horse trail ride, come back and do some nectars. We need to sell them because we need money for the house. Okay, garden time. And by the way, look at my beautiful lemon tree. It is beautiful. Hope we're gonna talk to you in a bit. You're a little hungry. So go drink some water. Let's refill the feeder with prairie grass and tell her to go eat it. We have reached level three of gardening. That is great. Look at my animals all happy and awake so croquetta where are you now still at the equestrian center i see okay that is not weird at all but whatever i'm gonna get the stable gossip i'm gonna talk to i'm gonna whisper to her scratch her neck they're still just friends right <laughs> let's brush her coat rub her neck just do everything make her feel happy hug her look at what a beautiful good horse she is i love you so much baby and by the way i have this always on the move thing no thank you <laughs> I'm not doing these quests. I don't care about them. Thank you very much. And okay, before going on a trail ride, maybe I should cheer for simoleons and milk for simoleons. And then we're gonna be ready to go. You know, I woke up at 3 a.m. It's already 8. Oh, there you go. You're just pooping some. I'm so happy. I'm gonna put all my poops in this box. We gained a lifestyle, an outdoorsy lifestyle. Good to know. I'm so very happy. And by the way, hope. Please eat before we go. You need your power. Let me just see. That's very interesting. My horse has handiness level one. That is called talent. I have a horse that can do it herself. Do it! She can upgrade regular household objects and even dabble with a bit of word working. Have you ever known a horse to do that? No, you have not. But I said I wanted to work on my endurance. We're gonna do it by going for a ride in her temperament. I need to care for and socialize with the horse. Okay, so that we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna go on trail rides and talk to a horsey. And by the way, stop with the things. I don't want these quests, okay? And Makoa is calling me because he loves me. You used to call me on oh my. You used to, you used to. My friend has been really toxic towards me lately, but I really care about them. Should I get rid of that friend? Is he talking about his wife? He probably is. His wife is pretty toxic. Yeah, you should. 
definitely do that. Okay, we are good on everything. Let's discuss the probability of time travel and let's go on a trail ride. We're gonna go out around four with Oscar, so we still have a little bit of time. Let's go for an energetic ride. And by the way, honey, it is like 1000 degrees outside. You can put your hot outfit on. You look hotter in it anyway. And now let's... Woohoo! Beautiful morning ride. Okay, there we go. We have reached level six of horse riding. She is gaining confidence in her riding abilities and it will affect her mood when riding. Good to know. Well, that's real nice. This world is so very pretty. You just went through a fence. Nice. We reach endurance level five. Sims will not be able to compliment physique on hope. I am so doing that later, honey. You look great. And by the way, after going for the trail ride, why don't we come here for a bit? Let's canter here please i want to go there because i want to harvest the prairie grass we still have a little bit of time to do that you're looking good on that horse you're looking so very confident on her and there you go riding up into the night all righty hope why don't you take a little break i'm gonna dismount you there you go you look beautiful i'm gonna be friendly and tell you that you look so hot i'm gonna compliment your physique you look great let me see what that looks like yeah you are hot honey keep that head held high beautiful girl okay let's harvest all prairie grass please we found one trash nectar hope is taking a little nap an onion one normal quality horse manure hello my cheeps and goats a strawberry nectar a normal quality horse manure again have a lot of those though okay now that you're done with this one you don't need to do anything anymore stop harvesting from the prairie grass mount your horse and let's let's go on a relaxed ride and go home to prepare for our date canter here and then we're gonna canter home there you go girl you're so fast look at you so confident on that horse so very proud of you okay we are here let's go back home now turn around and go good job home sweet home dismount hope tell her to drink some tell her to eat some and tell her to sleepy pie by the way let me put my nectars in my things if there's space for them of course yes there are that is great got some leftovers poop take a shower brush your teeth and take some power naps and we're calling up oscar it's already late croquetta is thinking of leaving oh great you decided to come out i'm gonna call you over why are you all the way there oh bottle feed you i'm gonna i have to clean all dirty mini sheep okay this life is hard just call her over don't come all the way here let her come to you come on croquetta get over here my god they're like my little children i can't go anywhere without but okay, I think I am ready for my date with Oscar. Let me just see what my dress looks like. Like, this is my formal wear and this is my party wear. Yeah, she looks cute. I'm gonna wear the party wear to our date. But I am going to invite him over first. He will be right over waiting for you at my front door. There you are. Okay, that's interesting. Your choices of clothing my love did i not give you a summer outfit oh no i didn't well you're gonna wear this i'm sorry you're gonna be warm but that's just the deal and okay now that you're here oscar i am gonna ask you out on a date and by the way i have a rule for all my dates with all three brothers i cannot kiss or woohoo them until i decide who i'm gonna be with because i really hope that i can like ask the other brothers to be my friends when i get with the other one and he's very flirty right now i'm very flirty when oscar is around me too but yeah i just wanted to tell you that rule because it just has to be this way and the lot i placed in the world is called golden horse restaurant there it is and we're gonna be going here for our date i hope you're ready oscar i'm just gonna have some chocolate Alrighty, Rue, here we are. Let me just pause. And also, will I ruin the date if I go in cast and change his clothes? It's so freaking warm. I'm sorry, I'm not risking losing my date, so you're gonna be like this. So where do you want to sit, love? Do you want to, like, sit outside or do you want to sit inside? I think it would be more romantic outside. So how about we get this little table here? I think that would be cute. Okay, we requested a table. Let's go and sit. Oscar, what are you doing with your outfits? I do not understand you. I told you to go with this outfit you're gonna be in this outfit for the love of god well here we go i'm gonna order right away before you know it they don't bring us the food so i'm thinking that we should take some love potions the chef's choice is a pita and hummus tapa whatever that means i'm gonna have empanadas empanadas because i like that and oscar's gonna have the specialty thing and as for a dessert oh that's the main course no i don't need no main course thank you i need dessert vertical berry cake that's 
sounds cool. There's an alien fruit tart, vanilla seashells and chocolate caviar. Oh my God, yes. Thank you very much. I can't wait for them to come and take my order. But for now, I need to socialize about meal with my date and have a deep conversation. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna do some romance. I'm gonna flirt some. I'm gonna compliment his appearance. Be like, you're looking great. Let's have a deep conversation. Was that a kiss? What was that? Oh my God. You can express your admiration. That's fine. We have learned that he is materialistic. Indeed he is. So are we. Oh my God, he is so cute. And he has the sinister personality archetype. They are always up to no good, trying to achieve their goals no matter the consequences. How true is that? If you watched Pasión de Gavilanes, you know what I'm talking about. We also know that he's a snob. Let's talk about the date and talk about our recent meal. If it's gonna ever come. Yeah, I don't think our food is gonna come, but thank God I ate before I came here. He's still very flirty. That's so cute. Oh my god, she thinks he's adorable. Aww. That is so sweet. Oh, it's 9 p.m. It became a dark outside. That's so interesting. So tell me more about yourself. I can congratulate him on his new job. What are you doing, by the way? Let me ask about your career. Oh my god, she's like so enthused about this date. She has not shut up the whole night. How can I socialize about the meal when nothing is coming? I'm gonna ask him about his romantic interests, because why not? We can already have our first kiss, but as I said, we're not doing that. Let's just do a nice pickup line. Oh, and by the way, look at the Itos are here. They're so cool. And Hilary Laurent and Hector Laurent. Oh my god, that is so cute. Actual families come to this place. That is so nice. How about we exchange our numbers? I'm still exploring, trying to figure stuff out right now. Okay, and I'm very flirty. Hold on, let me see his profile. Betty's sentiments towards him are cooking together, closer from happy memories, and she adores him, and he has the cooking together and friendly advice. The fact that we helped him find a job. That is so cute. We perceive him still as attractive. It's too early to tell, but there could definitely be something there. There may be something there that wasn't there before. Most definitely, yes. And he's an astronaut. Well, that does pay well. <laughs> and it is like... You have to be really smart, but if I date him in the future, he's gonna manage his own business. I don't think he's gonna be an astronaut, but for now, you know what? Try what you will, honey. And throughout the conversation, Betty got the impression that Oscar finds her quite attractive, making her wonder if she has the right idea. You most certainly do, baby. He just kissed his phone for your number. I'm just gonna slip in and ask if he's single, you know? Just... Yeah. And also, is there no music here? I would have loved to dance or something. Should I take him to the nightclub? I mean, I'm gonna go to the bar with Franco, so maybe I could take him to the nightclub now. Oscar is single. A single Pringle for me to mingle. Nice, nice, nice. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna give up this table. Oh, well, that was fast. And I think that Oscar, since we're having such a great time, we should take this date to a bar. And she's telling a joke about a horse, of course. That's cute. Okay. The date is gonna end in an hour, but I don't have that much time. And now we are traveling. Even though he's gone, he's probably already at the nightclub. Oh, no, he left. No, Oscar, we're going to the bar. Do not leave me. I am not allowing you to leave me okay i'm getting stressed and eating chocolate don't do that hello brothers excuse me i'm just here to pick up oscar this is not awkward at all see he has a heart on fire but okay let's get to the bar now i can put on my party outfit on all righty boo here we are we're still feeling a uh, very flirty how about we change our outfits to our party wear and oscar you can stay in that let's go and sit here together i'm gonna order a drink for everyone let's get something strong let's get some um, dim and gusty and we are gonna dance just like we did a couple of episodes ago oh you're flirting something he's talking something nice oh my god we can whisper seductively that's not against the rules it's not a kiss it's just a whisper in your ear oh look it's candy bear my friend sorry candy though i'm a little uh, preoccupied at the moment okay that was not weird at all drink you need to get drunk Dance the night away, babies. Dance the night away, because soon we need to leave. It's just that we have an early day tomorrow, and I still want to do some of the stuff that I had to do, so yeah. Alrighty, Rue Oscar, this is great. I can see you're ordering another drink. You can stay here if you want, but I'm just gonna come and embrace you, and I need to go. I'm sorry, I just have a lot of work to do. I had a great time on our date, and I hope to see you soon again. Can he, like, go for the first kiss? If he first kisses me, I won't say anything. She wants to ask him to be... 
her boyfriend. You know what? We need to leave like right now. Oh, there you go. You're just flirting. You don't want to leave each other. But you have to. Okay, you're going out with another brother tomorrow. So just please go home. Alrighty, we're home, sweet home. And since you're not that sleepy yet, why don't you go and harvest all there is to harvest? Sweet this. And I can fertilize things. <gasps> we have grapes. Forget the weedin. The weedin can wait till morning. I would like to craft nectars, darling. And I hope that crinkle top tomorrow is gonna like pop up and say I want to buy all your nectars for great money. Let's craft a grape nectar and apparently I can do a strawberry nectar as well. So go on ahead and do those things once you're done. And then I can send you off to sleep. You have had a very productful day. Yeah, take off your shoes and let's do this after all the fun you've had tonight. Okay, the grape nectar is ready. How did you do? It's normal. Good job, honey. Okay, now you're working on the strawberry one. Try not to fall down, honey. <laughs> And you did. Great. Okay, since you're done with that, go take a brisk shower and go to sleep, honey, because soon we gotta be waking up. Okay, this is normal again. Ugh, we have some more quality manures. Let's actually take a power nap or maybe even two and then we can take care of our garden. Perfect. Go weed this and water them all. I do have a place for one more nectar, so after you do that one, I'm gonna have to take care of my sheeps and goats if they're anywhere here. Barbie! What are you doing here and why are you all at the end of the city like what are you even doing here you're all in different places oh my god before you clean this with vigor please call them over and by the way i'm gonna sell my not so good quality manures oh my god oscar reyes is calling me hey betty i've been thinking about getting to know faye harris better as a friend do you think the two of us should hang out are you trying to make me jealous because you are if i were you i wouldn't do that okay don't 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 do that. Why would you want to hurt me like this? Please clean this with vigor and let's do one more nectar and it's gonna be it's gonna be strawberry. I like the strawberry better. I don't know why. But first you gotta clean this. That's right. Good job, girl. So very proud of you. And once you're done, I want to take care of my sheeps and goats, sell some nectars, and I think I will be done for this video. And there we go. She's crushing it. Better is stomping their way to nectar fame. Would it be safe to say that she likes nectar making? Yeah. Most definitely. Let me just save my game because I didn't do that in my previous episode of my not so berry and it was a problem okay sweetie good job i am so very happy with you it is excellent so are you beautiful job girl let's Put this in our inventory. Are there any more horse poops around here? And Oscar! <laughs> hey, baby. Wanna have a quick woohoo session? If not, we could just relax together. I will answer that after all my three dates. But for now, I'm gonna say no. Thank you. It's very hard to say no. In fact, I can't press it. But I have to. Okay. Another time. Sheeps and goats time, Barbie. Let's shear you and care for you. Actually, let's first clean all dirty sheeps and goats. Okay, go to my goat face and my hope do not like each other. That's great. Oscar is texting again. Hey, Betty, I kept thinking about you and ended up in your neighborhood. Do you mind if I come over? He is so in love. He loves me. But you can't, okay? I'm, I'm about to go out with your brother. You can't. No. You need to be patient. Okay, let's clean go to my goat face. And where is was this croquetta? Where is Tina? There you are, Tina. You are finally back. I am going to clean you, bottle feed you, and share your first annoyance. Oscar, you came anyway. Why? If you're looking to sell your homemade nectar, I'd be happy to sell. Yes. Hold on. Everyone, sheep, goats, everyone. I'm I'm not free right now. Okay, we have this moderately aged. Moderately aged. Moderately aged. Okay, let's see the other box. So we have three, four, five, six bottles that we could give to him. And in fact, you know what? I have so many grape nectars. I'm gonna sell them all. I'm gonna sell them all because I have the chance to do that. And okay, crinkle top. I wish I could teleport to you, but it's just... I'm gonna run to ya. In fact, you know what? We're not even gonna chat. I'm just gonna go on ahead and sell my nectar. And then I'm getting back to my animals. That's all for the- No! That's not all the nectars for today. You are going to take my nectars, all right? Here he is. Howdy! I can see you're holding a nectar in your hand. Want another one? Or maybe seven? Okay, he's taking them all. Let's see how much money he is going to give me. 4,522 simoleons. Uh, just like that. She got so happy and so am I. We have made 20,000 simoleons from selling nectars. Just FYI. And one of 50 extra excellent bottles of nectars. Great. Okay, that was everything, sweetie. Thank you so much for your time. And if you would excuse me, now it's time to shear my sheeps and goats.
once. First, I'm gonna bottle feed you. And Tina, once again, you're gone somewhere. Oh, you're inside. Oh, thank God. Run, girl. Run faster. You should have taken your horse. I'm sorry. I didn't think this through. But this is the last thing I'm gonna ask of you today. Don't worry. Some more money. Come on. Two more money and then we're done. Oscar wants me to go over at his house. Oscar, I love you. Not yet. But he is persistent. I like that. Okay, you guys. I think I will be ending things here. My girl Betty has done a fine job today. We took out Oscar Reyes out on a date and he fell in love with us. Great job for us. We created nectars. We sold nectars. We gardened. We worked on our horse skills. We worked on the actual horse skills. And we took care of our sheep and goats. There is nothing more that I would want in this world. I hope you're ready for the next episode when we're gonna take Franco out on a bar and dance and drink all night. And of course, still stick to the things that we have to do in every episode, like great next doors and blah, blah, blah. I wanna thank you guys so, so much for watching. I love you so much and I hope to see you next time, honey buns. Bye!